It's Patrick from the Screenplay app, the app for student screenwriters. Every week I recommend a new screenplay for you to read to get a better understanding about the art of screenwriting. This week's recommended read is When Harry Met Sally. This is a classic by all means. If you haven't seen the film, watch it. Read the screenplay. The screenplay itself, one particular detail about the screenplay is right away as soon as you start reading, the writer tells you that you're watching a movie and they set their own rules, which is very, very, very cool. Right away, you know, okay, this writer is putting me in this world and this is the rules that they set in this world. This screenplay is great overall. If you're a comedy writer, I highly recommend you study the screenplay, you read the screenplay, you dissect the screenplay. This is good for any writer, particularly though, if you are a comedy writer, read the screenplay and find out what makes it work so well. One thing I could tell you is the dialogue and the characters. The dialogue is just amazing. It's witty, it's clever, it's snarky. Just everything about this is is uh, um, it's emotional. I can't think of one flaw this screenplay has. I'm sure, you know, if someone were to break it down scientifically, yes, they could find flaws. However, if we're just talking about just creativity, this screenplay just checks all the boxes of just being a wonderful screenplay. The arc of the characters is amazing. Just the character descriptions. Everything about the screenplay just works. Obviously, the screenplay was written so well, it translated so well to the actual finished product, which we have the film, When Harry Met Sally. This screenplay is one of those screenplays where the story is timeless. It's about friends becoming lovers. It's a timeless story. And the story, even though it came out a long time ago, honestly, this screenplay still resonates to this day. If you were to read this screenplay today, you would have never known it was written back then because it's a classic and classics just don't get old. Another detail about this screenplay, which is very cool, is oftentimes when a screenplay is turned into a film, you see the film, but you don't see a lot of details that the screenplay has. An example, the scene descriptions, aka action lines, a lot of times a writer's unique voice also shows in the action lines. The action lines are the scene description where they're telling you what's happening, what the characters are doing. Obviously, audiences watching the film, they don't get to see this unique side of the writer. This is what's wonderful about reading screenplays because you also get to see what the writer is writing that no one else gets to see. Yes, in the finished film, the finished products, people get to see the characters and the dialogue and things like that. But when you read the screenplay, little things here and there that you see, the writer may have a specific uh, way of telling us how a character enters the room where it may not translate well into the film. The film itself is its own classic. I also believe the screenplay by itself, it's its own unique piece of uh, historic material. Yes, as you could tell, I really, really love this screenplay. And if you do read it, I think you'll also enjoy it as much as I do. You may not enjoy it as much as you do the film. Obviously, there's the actors also bring a certain, uh, a certain aspect to the film that the screenplay does it. The screenplay is so close to the finished material, I believe you'll enjoy both as much as I did. This is a great, great screenplay. Study the screenplay, learn from it, and go out there and write some great comedy. And hopefully, you write a classic like When Harry Met Sally. I will link the screenplay for When Harry Met Sally in the description below. Remember, this is for educational purposes only. If you're thinking about writing your first screenplay, Go to your favorite app store, download screenplay app today. The link is in the description below. And remember to always have fun writing. Fade out.